Uh, yeah, by the way, how do you think about the architecture, like the modules? Do they make sense? It depends what you're trying to achieve. When you say it doesn't make sense, in which context? There's no perfect architecture. They say it makes sense for all the cases, right? So you have pretty much here, I can see like uh, horizontal slicing. For example, you have the application module and it uses all the other modules, right? Yes. Uh, the core module is like uh, utilities, like some extensions I always use. And the domain module should be like standalone, doesn't depend on anything. And the data module is like the network database. What the dependencies here? So domain depends on core? Uh, pretty much everything depends on core. Uh, I don't like that <laughs> <laughs> because every time you change the core here, you need to recompile, redeploy everything. Core is just some uh, extension method, like say, uh, convert integer to string. And... and the application depends on domain and it depends yeah. on data. Data, yes. Data depends on domain. The data also depends on domain. Something like this, right? Yes. So every feature domain will be in the domain module. So if you add 10 features, all the domain for those features will be in the same domain module, right? Uh, yeah. So let's try to organize this. You know, layers. So this is usually called the horizontal slicing because you slice your application like horizontally and you put everything domain specific here. So you have your places and if you add another feature, you will also add in the same module. You say like, does this make sense? And you ask, what is the context? And you say, oh, we are in a team where you have future teams and we have three teams working independently, then it doesn't make sense because you have three different teams with different backlogs, with different deadlines working on the same module. And it's strange. You can get in each other's way. Then you would say, no, you want vertical slicing. Each feature will have its core, its domain, its data, its application in separate modules. But if you say, no, it's just one simple application and it's only three people working on it, maybe you don't even need all these modules, right? It could be just one module. Mm. That's why it depends on the context. Okay. And you will also see this in the main module of the program, how to make those decisions based on the team structure, the skills in the team, how many people work in the team, all those will change how you make those decisions. The complexity of the project. Do you need to reuse some, some functionality here across applications? For example, if you want to reuse the domain layer into another application, then you separate in a module like this. But if you don't, maybe you keep one, everything in one module will be simpler to maintain. So there's no one way of structuring our app that will work in all scenarios. You need to make the decision based on the requirements.